Pinpoint Weather Report is sponsored by Anderson Plumbing, Heating and Air. Nobody wows clients like we do. Angelica joining us once again, watching this uh, red flag warning and uh, Santa Ana conditions out there so dry, Angelica. It is, Kim. It is so dry outside, but that is not going to be changing any time soon. This dry weather pattern is going to continue with more possible threads of Santa Ana conditions. The one we have now in place will continue through the weekend. So taking a look, a look outside, it looks like nothing's happening out there. It's pretty quiet in downtown San Diego, 62 degrees. The wind's coming out of the north and northwest at three miles per hour, but it is much cooler today. 45 degrees in Julian, 36 in Mount Laguna. 62 in El Cajon and also 64 degrees in La Jolla. Over the last 24 hours, you can see the difference about 9, 8 degrees from Poway to Kearney Mesa, but coastal communities are actually seeing an improvement. Our fire danger headlines. Here's what we can expect. A red flag warning will remain. Fire danger is also going to be possible into next week. Gusty winds but not as strong as earlier today. So we are seeing some improvement already. Our high wind warning has officially expired, but Santa Ana winds will return over the course of next week, especially Monday and Tuesday. A red flag warning in effect for our valleys back to the mountains until 10 p.m. Saturday night. And for coastal communities, tomorrow is going to be elevated surf and dangerous uh, rip currents. That's what, let me go back so you guys can see it, that new color that's showing up, that's a beach hazard for our coastal communities. And this includes all of our coastal areas. You can see there are also a small craft advisory, which is going to be a concern for anyone boating. The winds right now at 32 miles per hour in Ramona, 28 miles per hour in Julian, and 30 in, in Alpine. The winds have improved over the last hour, but I'm expecting those winds to get stronger overnight into tomorrow. The areas to watch will be those areas under the red flag warning, Poway, Ramona, Julian, potentially expecting wind gusts as high as 40 miles per hour into tomorrow. So this is not over yet. There is very little moisture in the atmosphere, so dry, only 12% in Alpine and even 10% in Carlsbad, where we had wind reports earlier today of winds over 40 miles per hour. So this was a wide spread event and it is going to be a prolonged event as far as the threat for fires. 69 degrees at the coast tomorrow, sunny skies, 40s overnight. Inland communities will stay in the mid 70s on Friday but windy with wind gusts of up to 40 miles per hour. Our mountains will be in the mid 50s tomorrow, sunny and windy with that fire danger into the weekend. Conditions do improve slightly on Sunday and then the winds will be back. It's going to be most likely a weak event as far as Santa Ana conditions are expected for next week. But really we just need a shift in the atmosphere, a storm of some sort of some moisture across the area because it is just way too dry. Mm -hmm. Certainly is weaker is better though. Thank you, Angelica. ABC 10 News will be 